Welcome, I'm Derek Massing with the Ibex Division of Forest River. We're here in beautiful Ligonier, Indiana today, and I'm so happy you're here because we're getting an exclusive tour of our new Plant 91 facility that's building the Ibex travel trailers. Let's take a look. Safety first. Our brand new production facility is 94,000 square feet to exclusively build Ibex travel trailers. This new facility is gonna allow us to have expanded production so we can make even more happy campers of the amazing Ibex travel trailer line that has hit the industry by storm. Today, we're gonna to go through each of the 36 steps on how this Ibex is brought to life and comes from our facility here in Indiana to your campsite at home. Come on, let's take a look. of an Ibex starts here. The very first thing we do is we're gonna pull all of our steel frames inside get it, to get them ready for production. Now, inside here, you can see our first couple steel frames ready to be brought in along with our floors. Now, the inception of the Ibex life has actually started belly up so that we can install a lot of the features and components on the underneath first. It's the very first thing that's gonna happen here. So you can see all of our tanks are gonna be installed very first thing along with the heat pads that come standard on all Ibex travel trailers. You can see things like plumbing, wiring, all these different features are built into the underbellies. Very first thing, getting all of the vitals for your Ibex travel trailer ready as we move it down the production line. Now, the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get our leveling jacks, our four point scissor jacks installed onto the frame. And we're also gonna get our axles installed along with the tires right here in this very next step. This is the last thing we're gonna do while this thing's upside down and then we're gonna flip it upright and move it onto cleats so this thing can be rolled down the production line step by step. So at this point, we're already three steps into production. Now, one thing I'd like to point out before we continue looking at our production facility is we've got our own in-house cabinet shop. So all of our cabinets are built here right on site in Ligonier, Indiana. This allows us to keep all of our quality control in-house and be able to build everything right here on site just in time before we need it here. It's gonna cut down on the transportation of all these items that allow us to be more efficient in our production facilities. Now, so many people ask, how is it that we get all the big features inside this Ibex? Well, the simple answer is we put all the big stuff in before we put our walls up. So this very first step here, now that we're upside right, is cabinet set. We've got our vinyl flooring down here. This is a floating floor that's stapled all the way around the outside, allowing us to then put everything right on top, minimizing the seams and cuts for our flooring, making this a true seamless floor. Once we put all the big features inside, we can start to determine the layout that we're building by building the bed base, the kitchen layout, as well as the bathroom. Along with that, we're gonna start running some of the plumbing and electrical here, right, right away here in the first step of our Ibex production. Another small detail I'll point out is with this full aluminum floor, we're gonna put wood blocks in all the corners here so that as we install or clamp anything into this, we're not gonna crush the tubing of our aluminum framing. That's a very important and often missed production step that other competitors may not do, that we're making sure that attention to detail is seen in every step and every detail of Ibex travel trailer. As we continue along, now we're gonna start bringing those wires that we saw in those first steps from the underbelly up to the top of the unit. So a lot of our wire harnesses are being set so we can plug in things like lights, outlets, our furnace, our water heater, and other features like that. Along with that, we're starting to hook up things like our sink, our shower and all of the vital plumbing, the guts, the organs of our Ibex are all being installed here. Along with that, we see that our shower basin is supported underneath with two by fours and additional decking underneath to ensure a stable, sturdy shower pan every time you step in to take a shower in an Ibex travel trailer. Now that we have the majority of the inside, the interior finish set and in place, now it's time to get the walls up on our Ibex travel trailer. Now, all of our walls are laminated here right at our nearby lamination facility. Again, allowing us to control more of the production steps 
for each and every Ibex travel trailer. Now, each and every wall is gonna have all the major openings framed out in aluminum. That's gonna give us a stronger sidewall as well as making it lighter and more durable over the years. Along with that, we've eliminated the often used Luon particle wood board in our interior, our exterior sidewall production here. We've replaced that with a composite Asdel, which is not affected negatively by water, isn't gonna swell, rot, or break down over time. Along with that, it's a better insulator against sound and temperature, meaning it's quieter inside your camper at night, and it's gonna allow you to regulate the inside temperature more efficiently as you're camping in different climates. As you can see here, the Ibex travel trailer has had the slide box cut out. Now that piece is being sent ahead a few steps so they can build that slide out, again, right here on site. By us controlling the production of a lot of our components, we're able, again, to keep that quality control very high and in-house here and keep our workers in Ligonier, Indiana, doing all these important tasks. As that piece is set aside here, we're going to continue plugging in and setting a lot of our electrical features inside, including our exclusive road vac, central vac system, a lot of our lights and outlets, and other vital, important electrical components inside. We've also, at this point, now put the lid on our Ibex travel trailer, and we have all the roof decking up top. Now, our roof decking up top is going to have four-inch drop between the center of our trusses to the outside, allowing any type of debris or water to roll off freely. That's going to keep all those nasty things off top, meaning the roof material is going to stay cleaner and free of all those debris over the years. At this point, the main structure of our Ibex travel trailer has already been built. We've got our frame set, our floor set, and we've got all of our walls in place. Most of our electrical components have already been hooked up, so now it's time to start putting in some of those extra features, like our dinette, our couches, our beds, and those other things that are gonna finish out the floor plan that we're building this day. Now that we've moved about halfway down the production line, we've got all of our lights turned in our Ibex travel trailer for the first time. Our slide box has been built right here on site and has been put inside the travel trailer. And we're making sure that all of our major electrical components that are plugged in so far are working and up to standard. Now that we have the major structure of our Ibex travel trailer built, one of my favorite parts, getting to climb up the mezzanines, or the upper level of the Ibex production facility. So you can see here on my left, I've got an Ibex that does not have our roof material set yet. So this very next step is rolling out the one-piece PVC roof material that's gonna top every Ibex travel trailer. The great thing about our PVC roof material is it's a one-piece roll that rolls over the top of the entire unit, ensuring that everything is sealed up top properly. Along with that, it's gonna feature a 15-year warranty it's the toughest scratch and tear resistance material in the industry. The last thing we love about this PVC material is it's got a lot of ability to deflect the UV rays and heat off the top. So again, allowing our Ibex travel trailer to stay cool as you chase the sun in those hot climates. Another thing that's been so important to have in this brand new giant Ibex production facility is that we've got the space and room to store all of our major components inside. So many of our competitors are working out of cramped spaces where they're forced to leave a lot of their major components, supplies, and materials outside in the inclement northern Indiana weather while a unit waits to get built. With us having all this space, everything is stored neatly and safely inside, assuring these materials are protected from that nasty weather. Now that the main structure of the Ibex is built, now it's time to finish off the exterior features by installing all of our baggage doors, our windows, and anything else that's important and vital to the outside of the travel trailer. Inside, it's still a work in progress. We're starting to get some of our other features set and get ready for the next step of making this Ibex travel trailer not just functional, but also beautiful. You can see in these two steps, we've added a rear ladder and we've got our spare tire that's standard on all units right here. We're also getting all of our full length awnings set because those are going on here in this very next step. So at this point, we now have windows, we have doors, we have our awning in place. Now the last thing to do is finish off our cabinet sets, our furniture, and all those last features that are not gonna make your Ibex just functional, but also comfortable, beautiful, and long lasting for years to come. So as you can see, we've got about six or seven steps left. 
And these last six or seven steps are some of the most important because these are gonna ensure the best fist and finish in the industry of any travel trailer. Now, that starts with us having super bright lights so as our workers are inspecting and finishing off all the last features inside, it's easy to see all of those fine details that make Ibex the nicest travel trailer that you're gonna see. Inside right now, we've got fascia board going on. We've got our bunk curtains being installed, our bunk ladder being installed. We've got blinds and all these other nice finishes being put in. Our cabinet doors have started to be put in place and you can see the, the units lit up and beautiful and really starting to come along. At this point, we just have five steps to go to finish off this travel trailer and bring it to your local dealer for you to go purchase. So now we're down to just the last couple steps here. As you can see, it's cleanup time. We've got our mattress in place and we've got our dinette cushions in place, our table, and all those last important features ready to go. So now it's just time for final cleanup and inspection in this very last step. Here in this last step is where we're inspecting the final details to make sure everything looks good, works well, and is up to your high expectations as an RVer. This is an important step in making sure that the Ibex travel trailer shows beautifully at your dealer so that you can go in, buy it, and be camping in no time. The very last thing this Ibex is gonna do before this rolls off the assembly line is be weighed here and making sure that every unit shows the exact weight so that you are comfortably towing and knowing that you're well within your limits on your tow vehicle. As a bonus to our sneak peek of our new production facility here in Ligonier, Indiana, is our bonus room. It's the CAI room, Customer Insurance Inspection. And what we're gonna do is, randomly throughout the week, we're gonna pull several units off the production line after they've been completed to make sure that everything is working at the highest standard. So everything is getting a thorough inspection from all electrical systems, your slide system, your plumbing, and anything else that may affect the operation. That ensures that as our production line is building Ibex travel trailers, that the highest quality standards are being met by our team and that everybody is comfortable and happy with the product that leaves Ligonier, Indiana before it heads to your local dealer. I hope you enjoyed this exclusive sneak peek at our brand new Ibex production facility. It's time for us to get back to hard work, building you the industry's most exciting new travel trailer brand. For you, it's time for you to go home and visit forestriverinc.com slash Ibex to pick out your favorite floor plan and to find your local Ibex dealer. Thank you.